Paul's Maladins. Not as well as he could have. Get over. <laughs> Look up there, would you? That shit here, fools. I ain't cleaning the splatter. What to do? Ready for you. It's on my mind. Faster! Heat up some rocks! Move! I don't have time for you. Dead. Drug me. Now move! I've got no time for the parasite stairs. A true soul, eh? Glad you're here to take us. He's stuck in there with poisoned geezers. We don't get him out soon. It's both our heads. That's so. Set it near the rubble and ignite it. That'll blow the drow out. One spark and it'll blow. Idea, I think. Things could always get worse for you. These are all you attacked someone. Only the guards are allowed to do that, as this one is about to demonstrate. <laughs> you attacked someone. Only the guards are allowed to do that, as this one is about to demonstrate. Slaves, your incompetence has been my ruin. Nay, does not fail. <laughs> so you care for the weak, true soul? Was it your hand that slayed Nir's servants? Or is there a sane explanation? Traitor. You have breathed your last. Another parasite collected. The decaying corpse lies before you. The head breaks off cleanly from the drow's body. Object catches your eye. A lantern, it seems. Though no light flickers within. Broken. And there's dust inside it. This is pixie dust, used to illuminate a lamp all left behind after a pixie's death. Nothing about the lantern strikes you as unusual. It was over in a flash. Please, I end. It could have been you. I can't bear to think about it. 
you don't need to. We're together. That's what matters. Oh, you're covered in dust. I'm not good here. Wait, I hope. Is that a bruise there? Stop fussing. It's nothing, I swear. I'm your husband. It's my job. I wouldn't have it any other way. Beldron! I was so worried. Didn't it hurt you? No, no, I'm all right. Did the sergeant hurt you? Oh, who cares? We're together now, thank Iron Hand. <laughs> we ought to thank someone a little closer by, I think. Gad El Iron Hand, you may not be, but you damn well fight like him. I'm grateful, don't mistake me, but why help us? You're one of them, aren't you? Glittering gods! I should have known that one was too damn stubborn to die. Here. The Iron Hand gnomes honor their debts. With Walburn gone, that falls to me. Make it quick. We need to find Walburn. Now! You're a little late, Barkus, my lad. He's already been sent to Moonrise Towers. We were just slave hands to the cult, but not Walburn. He knows things. Things they want to know, too. What has he gotten himself mixed up in now? You'll call me mad, but fine. Walburn's found the formula for rune powder. What? Aye. The explosive of Gerdel Iron Hand's own creation. Fistfuls, wiping out armies. All those old stories. Only Walburn couldn't leave the stories be, so he went and bloody found it. A small supply tucked away down here with a manuscript. He just made sense of the formula when the cult jumped us, so he burned the damn thing. If there's a single copy left, it's sitting in his head. Those absolutists pull it out and make rune powder, they could flatten the whole of the Sword Coast. <laughs> I wouldn't trust them with a bloody butter knife. But it's a fight for another day. My people can barely stand, and we have business back in the city. Business is what sent us after the powder to begin with. Now, we'll have to make other arrangements. And just like that, you'd leave Walbrin behind. I knew you lot were foolish, but I didn't know you were cruel. If you knew half as much as you think, my lad, Walbrin might have kept you around. <laughs> He'd admire your resolve and your optimism. My people will find somewhere to regroup across the lake, then on to the city. If you find yourself in Baldur's Gate, seek us out. We'll raise a glass to Walbrun together. Seems like a good moment to talk. <sighs> I'm coming along, just not fast enough. Any word on my people? You did? Then I owe you more than I can ever repay. Thank you. I'm almost sorry to hear it. I hope to have the pleasure myself. There's plenty more guarding my people, but I'd say you've made a fine start. Don't know. Longer than I'd like, but a slow recovery is still a recovery. Peace, Springer. Be at... Home. The drow sought to shatter our circle. Now his flesh may feed its growth. In dealing death, you have brought this circle life, and thus we name you Life Chanter. Thank you. 
As our circle grows, so shall your song. Wherever you go, only listen, and you may hear it. Thank you.